crystal clear. We have all this new technology and sending that all the way up to Mars gives us such a neat look. And Carlene, I know, self-proclaimed weather nerd, science geek, you're loving every minute of it. What'd you call me? Yeah, you said it. You've called it yourself. What? Excuse me. Weather, is nerd, it, it's it's simple when I geek. say it, but when you say it, <laughs> <laughs> no, you didn't, girl. Come on, it was endearing. I know. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Love you, Marcella. Uh, yes, I am. The I am a nerd. Fantastic, Carlene Chavez. Oh, hey. I'll work like with that. that. I right. do. I do. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> we're talking about that forecast. That was fantastic today. We had lots of sunshine that was out there. It was absolutely gorgeous. I posted the highs earlier today. Everyone was commenting. Just lovely. Loving the forecast for today. And as we go into tomorrow, much of the same is expected. We will see a few added high clouds to the scenery. Also some low clouds as well. But for the most part, we're going to stay pretty nice over the next couple of days. High today. Well, a lot of them in the 70s. We had that for the valley, 74 degrees. Valley Center, 73 degrees was the high in Escondido. We also still had those upper 60s closer towards the coast. 66 degrees in Oceanside today. That was a high higher than the desert. 65 degrees was the high for Borrego Springs. So west of the mountains, still talking about temperatures being above seasonal with those upper 60s, also the low 70s. And so most of our daytime highs were about 5 to 10 degrees above seasonal, all because of an area of high pressure. Now, as we go into tonight, we're talking about that high pressure system is going to be squashed out from an area of low pressure and that's going to steer in that onshore flow. We still have clear skies right now, but it won't stay that way. So patchy low clouds as well as some fog looks to develop in the overnight hours. But right now it's nice and clear for downtown 55 degrees current temperature and 72% relative humidity. So that weak ridge, it's getting squashed out all because of an area of high pressure that's going to move in from the Pacific Northwest. As a result, it's going to sweep towards the north of us. So not a rainmaker for us. We'll, we'll see a few high clouds by tomorrow. Kind of like we saw earlier today. Nothing is going to actually block out the sunshine, but we'll have some low clouds in the morning at times, especially with that marine layer moving in. And as onshore flow does resume, that will have our gusts peaking about 40 to 55 miles per hour. And that'll be for the mountains as well as the desert, mainly along the desert mountain slopes. So that will be the key for tomorrow. Also on the water, likely gusts around 20 to 25 knots and a high risk of rip currents at our local beaches. Because those wind speeds are going to pick up, that's for the mountains mainly impacting with this wind advisory. It's going to be a 12 hour period for tomorrow, starting at 6 a.m. And so gusts up to about 50 miles per hour, 55 in spots cannot be ruled out. So it's when we talk about these wind advisories popping up, it's a time to really think about just being cautious. If you're going to be driving through the mountains, especially both hands on the steering wheel, you have crosswinds and use caution, especially along the eight as well as Sunrise Highway. Taking a look at your forecast next couple of days. So onshore flow is going to get the weekend started, then offshore flow is going to close us out. And that will be the result of uh, Santa Ana winds returning. That's going to bump up our temperatures above seasonal by Sunday back into those 70s. And then talking about those 80s, so a ridge of high pressure building in as well as Santa Ana winds, 81 degrees. That will be the high for the inland valleys by Monday, lots of sunshine all the way into next week and temperatures peaking. That won't be until Tuesday for the mountains as well as the desert. Desert, you're going back into the 80s too. Back to you too.